Is it time to buy or sell Meta stock? In this video, we will explore Meta in depth. Our initial report was published on our website on Friday, the 23rd of August, 2024, and we are here to provide you with an even more comprehensive analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest insights. You don't want to miss any important updates that could affect your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched artificial intelligence stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Leverage the power of AI and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be regarded as financial advice. Since the 12th of August, 2024, our system has ranked Meta as a hold or accumulate, assigning it a score of 0.06. Now, let's take a closer look at the stock's performance during this time. The stock has undergone natural fluctuations, resulting in a gain of 2.34%. This equates to an average return of 0.23% per day since it was designated as hold or accumulate. The stock is positioned in the midst of a broad and relatively weak upward trend in the short term, indicating that further growth within this trend is likely. The current three-month trend points to a possible change of approximately 4.58% over the next three months, with expected returns ranging from negative 8.57% to positive 9.65%. Looking at the 12-month trend, it suggests an impressive change of 84.12% over the next year, with potential returns between 65.80% and 101.09%. This translates to a price range between $875.41 and $1,061.73 after a year. Our latest daily update for Meta includes the headline, Evaluation of Meta Stock Downgraded After the Last Trading Session. The Meta stock price experienced a decline of approximately 0.739% during the last trading day, which was on Friday, the 23rd of August, 2024. The price fell from $531.93 to $528. Throughout that day, the stock fluctuated by 2.82%, reaching a low of $525.06 and a high of $539.85. Although the price has decreased in six of the last 10 days, it remains up by 1.98% over the preceding two weeks. On the last day, trading volume decreased alongside the stock price, which is generally considered a positive indicator as volume typically aligns with price movements. The trading volume fell by 3 million shares, bringing the total to 11 million shares traded, amounting to approximately $5.76 billion. Over the past 52 weeks, the stock reached its highest price of $544.21, while the lowest price was $276.06. Currently, the price stands at 2.98%, or $16.21, below the 52-week high of $544.21, which also marks the all-time high for the stock. Meta has recently blocked a small cluster of WhatsApp accounts linked to an Iranian hacking group known as APT42, which targeted officials from both the Biden and Trump administrations. This incident highlights the ongoing cybersecurity threats that could affect user confidence and perceptions of privacy, potentially impacting Meta's user base and overall market sentiment in the short term. In a more strategic shift, the company has decided to halt plans for a premium mixed reality headset, which was initially intended to compete with Apple's Vision Pro after encountering challenges in the market. This cancellation from Meta's Reality Labs division indicates a redirection of resources, particularly as the division has already faced significant losses. 
The decision may signal to investors a reassessment of Meta's priorities and growth strategies, possibly resulting in mixed reactions in the stock market. Long-term implications may arise as investors keep a close watch on Meta's ability to streamline operations and concentrate on core revenue-generating segments rather than high-risk ventures. The combination of cybersecurity challenges and shifts in product strategy may influence Meta's stock price, with potential volatility as the market processes these developments. Overall, while the immediate effects may introduce uncertainty, a strategic refocus could ultimately position Meta for more sustainable growth in the technology landscape. Analyst Ratings On Friday, the 16th of August, 2024, it was reported that Tigress Financial assigned Meta a strong buy grade accompanied by a hold action. On Tuesday, the 6th of August, 2024, Loop Capital Markets rated Meta with a buy grade and a hold action. On Thursday, the 1st of August, 2024, Needham provided Meta with an underperform grade along with a hold action. On the same day, BMO Capital rated Meta with a perform grade and a hold action. Again, on the 1st of August, 2024, BMO Capital assigned Meta a market perform grade with a hold action. Analysts have assigned a general neutral rating to Meta stock. They classify the price-to-earnings ratio as a strong sell, and the price-to-book ratio also receives a strong sell rating. However, when it comes to return on investment, the analysts have rated the stock as a strong buy. The following signals have been identified for Meta. The Meta stock currently shows a sell signal from the short-term moving average. However, there exists a buy signal from the long-term average. With the short-term average positioned above the long-term average, a general buy signal emerges for the stock, indicating a positive outlook. As the stock progresses, it will encounter resistance from the short-term moving average at approximately $530.84. Conversely, should the stock decline, it will find some support from the long-term average at about $500.73. A breakthrough above the short-term average will trigger a buy signal, while a drop below the long-term average will result in a sell signal. Additionally, a buy signal is present from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, or MACD. Some negative signals have also been issued, which may impact the short-term trajectory. A sell signal emerged from a pivot top point on Thursday, August 15, 2024, with the stock having fallen by 1.74% since then. Further declines are expected until a new bottom pivot is established. The trading volume decreased alongside the price during the last trading day, which reduces overall risk, as volume typically aligns with price movements. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal, pivots, sell signal from seven days ago, Bollinger, buy signal from seven days ago. Short-term moving average, sell signal from two days ago. Long-term moving average, buy signal from 13 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages, buy signal from 12 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see short moving average, buy signal from 15 days ago. Long-term moving average, buy signal from 15 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages, buy signal from eight days ago. Remember to visit our page at stockinvest.us if you want to discover more signals. Support, risk, and stop loss for Meta. On the downside, the stock finds support just below today's level from accumulated volume at $497.74 and $488.14. There is an inherent risk when a stock tests a support level if this level is broken, the stock may then decline to the next support level. In this case, Meta finds support just below today's level at $497.74. If this level is breached, the next support from accumulated volume will be at $488.14 and $461.99. This stock exhibits average movements throughout the day, and, with substantial trading volume, the risk is regarded as medium. 
Over the last day, the stock fluctuated by $14.79 between its high and low, which represents 2.82%. During the past week, the stock experienced a daily average volatility of 2.16%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Meta, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, we have the price to earnings ratio, commonly known as the P-E ratio. This crucial metric measures a company's current share price in relation to its earnings per share. This is a relatively normal P-E ratio, often observed in companies with established track records or predictable revenue streams. In other news, the next earnings report for the third quarter of 2024 is anticipated on the 23rd of October, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates are set at $5.13. It's important to keep an eye on these figures as they can significantly influence stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Meta. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Meta is at $529.32. If you do not own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be surpassed before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a point to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Meta encounters its first support level at $497.74. If this support level holds strong, it could present a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for Meta from various analyst sources is neutral. Now let's examine some recent insider trades. On the 20th of August, 2024, Newstead Jennifer executed an insider sale of 905 shares of Class A common stock. On the same day, Anderson Aaron conducted an insider sale of 446 shares of Class A common stock. Additionally, on the 20th of August, 2024, Anderson Aaron executed another insider sale of 285 shares of Class A common stock. On the 21st of August, 2024, Zuckerberg Mark performed an insider sale of 444 shares of Class A common stock. On the same day, Zuckerberg Mark conducted another insider sale of 568 shares of Class A common stock. Analyzing the 100 most recent insider trades, we find that the insider power is negative, with a ratio of negative 33.998. In total, insiders acquired 77,857 shares and sold 158,188 shares in these last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $509.23, reflecting a decrease of 3.55%. This stock experiences medium daily fluctuations, indicating a moderate level of risk. A sell signal has emerged from a pivot top identified 21 days ago. Is Meta stock a good buy? Meta presents several positive indicators. However, we believe these are insufficient to classify it as a buy candidate at this time. Currently, it should be regarded as a hold candidate, suggesting that investors either hold their position or accumulate more shares while we monitor further developments. Given some minor weaknesses in the technical analysis, we have revised our evaluation from a buy recommendation to a hold or accumulate stance since our last assessment. Upon reviewing the volatility and trading patterns from the previous day, our analysis indicates that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Monday, the 26th of August, we anticipate that Meta will open with an increase of $2.97, starting at $530.97. We would like to remind you that trading involves a significant risk of losing money. It is advisable to consult with a financial advisor before making any decisions regarding the purchase or sale of securities. Please do not base your investment choices solely on the information from stockinvest.us. By utilizing this information, you acknowledge and accept full responsibility for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Please share your thoughts in the comments below. What is your target for the stock?
remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and hope you have a wonderful day. With warm regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.